I have a OnePlus Nord N100 here. I'm going to show you two ways how you can perform a factory reset. First way, we're going to do. I'm going to show you how to do a soft reset, meaning go into the settings. And the second way is a hard reset using the hard keys. Okay, so first way is let's go into the settings to do a soft reset, factory reset. So go into your settings. Then from here, go ahead and scroll all the way up, all the way up, and third to the bottom, it should say system. Let's tap on system, and then from here we're going to go ahead and we are going to choose reset options. So tap on that, and then down here it says erase all data factory reset. So tap on that. Now take note, this is very important, you have two options here, okay? You have this optional right here. So basically if you leave this checked here, you're going to erase all data, okay? So your photos, music. Everything is going to be long gone, and once the uh, factory reset is complete, it's going to be as if pretty much you bought this brand new and took it out of the box. Now you have the other option here. If you uncheck this, basically this is only going to erase um, system data. So it'll reset all your system data. However, your photos, videos, and your personal personal data and all that will still be on the phone. Okay, so that's the first way. Now the other way is a hard reset, a hard factory reset. So what you want to do for that is it's very simple, it's a two key combination. What we wanna do is press and hold the volume up and the power button, and do not let go until we see the OnePlus logo and then let go quickly, okay? So volume up, power, ready? One, two, three. Press and hold both buttons simultaneously. Do not let go, keep on holding until we see the OnePlus logo and then let go really fast. Still holding both buttons here, still holding. Where's that OnePlus logo? There it is, and let go, and voila. So we're in the options menu here, and then you use the volume rockers. To move up or down, you can see right here on the top. So what we want to do is just go to recovery mode and to select it, just press the power button. Okay. Give this one second here. Okay. Now go ahead and enter your PIN password. After you put in your password, tap on OK down here. From here, go ahead and tap on English. And now tap up here where it says white data slash cache. Okay, so let's tap on that. And then right here it says erase everything, including music, pics, photos, videos, the whole shebang. So let me just go ahead and factory reset this entire phone. I'm going to go ahead and tap right down here, erase everything. This cannot be undone. Um, so when you do it, it can't be undone. Also take note, this is very important as well. If you look down here in the red, if your phone is reset, factory reset, you will need to enter the Google account information, email, and password. Basically, it's your Gmail account associated with this phone to be able to use it again. So in other words, if you have your uh, N10, N1, uh, N100 here and you went to the email app and you put in one of your Gmail addresses, then once we do this, you are going to have to get that same email address with the password. Now, if you have like five different Gmail addresses like I do, what you have to, and that, that was in the email app, then you would have to just choose one of those and choose one of those passwords, okay? And if you don't have no Gmail address or Google account in there, then simply uh, once you perform this, you won't have to set that up or anything, and then you can just sell your phone, okay? So uh, this cannot be undone. Continue. So I'm going to tap on here. Now give this one second here. Wiping, please wait. Okay. Format is success. Now simply I'm going to go ahead and click on reboot right here. Now give it one second here, okay? So... So now, basically, this will be on here. You're going to have to wait about three minutes or so. And then once this is all done and your phone boots up, it'll be in a beginning process where you have to like choose your language, the beginning initial setup, as if you just bought it brand new and took it out of the box. So give this, give this like a few minutes. Okay, looks like it's booting back up. And voila! Questions, issues? Comment below.